Hi, this is Scoggin, and today what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how to season a grill pan, uh, and it's very uh, uh, simple. Uh, I, I was sent a grill pan by my good friend Robert Crow, uh, and uh, uh, this is the way the pan looks. This is a Mr. Barbecue grill pan. Uh, it has like the uh, uh, little ridges there and has like where the fat uh, and grease can go through. But uh, he, he uh, told me, uh, well, sent, uh, sent the letter and in his letter uh, he, he said that it uh, like took a couple of uh, uh, cookings before it got like kind of a metallic or a weird smell out. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get the weird smell out. And this pan, uh, like I say, it's a Mr. Barbecue pan, and it says that it comes pre-seasoned, but uh, apparently not. It's not seasoned enough. But I'll show you how I go about doing it, and uh, it's very simple. What I've done is I went ahead and took some Crisco oil. You can use any kind of oil you want to season a pan. Canola, peanut, uh, whatever oil you want, olive, I mean it don't matter because it's going to season this pan. And I'm going to show you how I'm going to do it. And I've already uh, went ahead and put the uh, oil and rubbed it around the uh, uh, surface of the pan and what I'm going to do is bake it in the oven. We're going to put it in the oven at 350 degrees for one hour. After one hour I'm going to bring it out, let it cool and then I'll have the second part and show you uh, what I do from there. But uh, very simple. It's not hard to season uh, one of these grill pans. Go ahead and show you what I've got. What I've got is I've got my uh, uh, bacon pan with tin foil, and all what I'm going to do is take this pan, and I've already, like I said, I went ahead and put the oil on it, and uh, put it just like that. This is going, I preheated my oven to uh, 350 degrees. This is going to go into the oven. and. Then after uh, uh, one hour of, of uh, baking at 350 degrees, I'm going to bring it out, and then I'm going to show you uh, how to preserve it and everything. And that will be in the second video. So uh, go ahead and get started. My oven is heated, and uh, we're going to go ahead and put that uh, in here. Gets a better turn on the light so I can see what I'm doing. And it just goes in like this. Like I said, the oil's on it. So, it's just going to go in that hot oven. And that's all it is to it. Let it go for one hour. After one hour, uh, we're going to bring it out, let it cool, and then I'll have the second video. Show you how to uh, go about seasoning it. It's not hard at all, uh, and it will just, uh, it will get that metallic uh, taste out and everything. Uh, like I said, it said that uh, Mr. Barbecue says that uh, it's pre-seasoned, but uh, I don't think so. So I'm going to go ahead and do it my way. So got, got it going, and uh, after an hour, let it cool down, and I have the second video coming up. This is Scoggett. Appreciate all you viewers and subscribers out there. Big shout out to you, Robert Crow, for sending me this wonderful gift. Oh, I am going to use this like crazy. And uh, have videos on it. This is going to be known as a Robert, uh, Robert Crow uh, uh, cast iron skillet. Like I have my James Ross tongs. Shout out to you, James Ross, my good friend. And uh, appreciate all you viewers and subscribers out there, and y'all take care.